Now we're going to walk through a number of different ways that you can zoom in on your model or whatever you're building in Rhino. And if you'll see up here, right along uh, the, this top toolbar here, this is really where those different zooms are. And we'll take a look at them and kind of how they work. This first one, uh, zoom dynamic. Let's click on it here, left click, and we'll go over. If you click and hold down and then drag it up, or down it will zoom in and out. Now this is very useful except for you have to go over and click on this toolbar here all the time. If you have a mouse with a roller wheel if you roll that roller wheel in or out you can zoom in and out and this is one of the main ways that I navigate around. I'll use uh, the roller on my mouse coupled with the right mouse button I'll click and hold it. I can spin it around here. And then I'll use the wheel and I can roll in, check it out, and zoom back out. Come over here, in and out. So there's a few different ways to do it. That's the main one that I use. Here's some other ones. You can zoom and actually pick a window and kind of a target as well. So we'll left click. Say we want to look uh, in this area here. Click and drag a marquee, let go. It'll zoom in. Uh, this this next one's pretty useful. It's zoom extents. If you left click it, uh, it'll focus right on the window or viewport that you have active. So let's do that. We'll left click. And it'll zoom out so the entire model fits into this viewport. Let's mess these up uh, a little bit here. Let's change that one. Zoom in. And we'll go back to the zoom extents. If you right click on it, you'll see it says zoom extents all viewports. We'll right click. There they go. They all go right back to the exact size that uh, they can be to fit into that viewport. So that one's very useful as well. There's a couple others here. Zoom selected. Um, if we left click here, if you select say this disk, um, and then you use zoom selected. We'll go in a little bit closer. Uh, and again, it really depends on the viewport that you have going on. Uh, the final zoom here is if you want to undo your view change. I don't use this hardly at all, but uh, let's left click here and then it'll just revert back to the last view that you did. So that's zooming in Rhino in a nutshell.